Good morning and happy Monday, friends. Today, we're working on the legs. So what we're going to start off with here is a little bit of a wall sit, lunge, and uh, squat hold combo. This one's going to burn you up pretty good, I hope. So we're going to start off each set with 30 to 60 seconds of a wall sit. What I want you to think for this wall sit is you're going to a distance where, like, it's starting to burn and get really, really uncomfortable, but you're not in danger of, like, falling off the wall. So if that happens for you at 30 seconds, do a 30 second plank. If it happens at 45, or it's not a plank, sorry, a wall set. If it happens at 45, cool. If you can go the full minute, awesome. And what I want you to be able to do is come immediately off that wall and go straight into lunges. You're going to do seven reverse lunges on your right leg, followed immediately by seven reverse lunges on the left leg. And then you're just going to squat down to a parallel hips in line with the knees and you're going to hold that for 15 seconds at this point your legs should be starting to get a little smoky here so uh if, if it burns you're doing it right i want you to rest a minute and a half and we're going to do that four times um i'm going to have videos of the squat hold and stuff but essentially you're going to squat down and just hold right at parallel um, for the lunges, if you know that seven in a row is a lot, you can scale that down to five, four, whatever it is. We're just trying to get some muscle endurance work here, and that's why we're doing them all on one side before we switch. So these are not alternating. That You're going to do four sets of that, and then we're going to move into our conditioning, which is 10 down to one of a single arm overhead squat. And then in between each set, you're going to do five half burpees. The half burpee is kind of like the bottom half of the burpee. So you'll start in the push-up position, and then you'll lower yourself down and then jump your feet up. I got a video of Tori demo in this. She looks much better than I do when I do this movement. So 10 overhead squats, five half burpees, nine overhead squats five half burpees, eight, so on and so forth. If the overhead squat is a real struggle for you mobility-wise, you can't keep that arm straight or you feel like you're not getting anywhere close to depth, that is okay. What I want you to do is either move into a goblet squat and work really, really deep range of motion, or you can try out an overhead lunge. And for these lunges, you would just alternate every single rep. So that's all completely based on your mobility. Some people will be able to overhead squat. Most people will not. So be careful and smart with your scaling. All right, that is Monday. Enjoy that workout, and we'll see you for Tuesday.